Greetings and welcome back to Pocket Ants. All right, we've had an update. It's got some adjustments in there for the beehive and beehive related issues. And um, I think you're actually going to like some of them because I know I certainly did. So why don't we take a look at them? Once again, the Google Play Store, where I'm actually getting these updates for, didn't really have a lot of details. Actually, it had details from November 16th, and of course, this is the 20th. So I once again went to the Discord. This time, I just grabbed the whole post here from the, uh, the developer. And uh, if uh, you're interested in actually getting these, if you see an update and you want to know what's in them, I got this from the Discord. There's a section on the left side about game announcements. Just go in there and go all the way to the bottom and you'll get the latest updates. They actually have all of the updates from all of the, uh, the updates that they have done. So if you want to watch the progression, you can do that. But just go all the way to the bottom for the latest and the greatest, which of course this is. All right, as I mentioned, these are adjustments to the Beehive. But of course, these are in progress, right? These changes may be changed again. So we're going to have to see how that works out. They're watching. Anyway, let's just talk about what we have here. Uh, there is now a reward limit of five per day. Okay, so I kind of mentioned that as a question in my last video. How many times can you actually do this, you know? I mean, if you had the resin, could you just keep doing it over and over again? Well, apparently now you cannot. So five times a day. You can actually see that in there once we get into the resin shop. We'll take a look at it when it comes. All right, so let's look at these. These are actually really nice. Entry price reduced from 500 resin to 300 resin. All right, that is definitely much more manageable in my book. You know, definitely. As a matter of fact, yeah, I'm going to be, uh, we're going to be talking about that. All right, the next one, of course, is resin reward increased from 1,000 to 2,000. All right, so I'm guessing that there was a outcry for the reductions and um, a thousand is a little low considering the amount of effort going on here. So 2000, I think is a, is a pretty good middle ground. So you're spending three to get two if you can run through it easily. So, you know, that might be something that's a good one. Maybe they'll adjust it again. I don't know. We'll have to see. All right, the next two kind of go hand in hand. And I think that this is a really big one right here. Base B essence timer increased from 6 minutes to 6 minutes and 30 seconds. Previously, to get that much, you would have to have done three updates, and they get kind of expensive in the resin department, you know, uh, 7,500, 25,000, and 50,000. So now, that's actually the base you're starting with. And speaking of those upgrades, B essence timer upgrades increased from 10 seconds to 20 seconds. So if you did go out and get those upgrades, well, they just doubled the effectiveness by doubling the amount of seconds involved there. So a lot more time to run around inside there and dealing with possible problems of touching the walls and such and losing time. Maybe if you have more time, you can be a little bit more careful making your way through the maze. All right, so those are the ones that directly affect the beehive. They have a couple of other things here, too. Readjusted termite amounts and spawn frequency. I have no idea which direction that goes in. I suppose we can try that right here in the video and see if it's better or worse. You know, because I don't really know. All right, uh, performance improvement. That's always a good thing. Yep. And the last one, fix the bug where sometimes flying creatures can't be attacked in battles. That sounds strangely familiar to the one in the previous update about the dragonfly. I'm wondering maybe if they're applying that to the hornet now too. Don't really know. Maybe it's something completely different. Okay, so let's look at the uh, resin shop here. All right, this is the one I'm talking about right here now. All right, so now it costs you 300 resin as opposed to 500 resin. The gem value is still the same. And you can see it says daily reward, zero of five. So you'll only be able to do this five times. So, I mean, that's a pretty good opportunity to get whatever reward you're going for, right? If you want to go crazy with the Hornets, you can get five a day. So I mean, I think that's kind of reasonable right there. And also, if you notice right over here next to it, it does say 6.30 minutes right now. Six minutes, 30 seconds. 
And of course, it's telling you right now, if you do this one increase, it goes to six minutes and 50 seconds. So you do another one, of course, and that'll be like seven minutes and uh, 10 seconds. And the one after that, if you've already done it already, you know, what is that, seven and a half minutes then at that point? So that's a lot of time to go in there to uh, maybe be careful and not touch the walls. Or if you do accidentally touch the walls, it's not as critical anymore. So that's actually, that's not so bad at all. Not so bad at all. So we just get rid of that. And as a matter of fact, given these changes, I'm going to take a shot at it on Sunday. Now, the reason I'm not doing it now is twofold. One, I want a little bit of time to study the maze. I don't know if I can actually do it because remember, I don't have any of the player ant speed things on and I don't see myself buying that anytime soon. The other reason is that if I'm going to do it, if I miraculously get the honeycomb out, I want to do a golden summon, right? So as I understand it, correct me if I'm wrong. If you have the honeycomb and you do a golden summon, you get a golden version. That's my understanding. If I'm wrong, correct me. So at the moment, I have 122. I'm not going to do any golden summons. I'm just going to try to save up, get the 150. Worst case scenario, where is it? Not here. Uh, actually, that is where it is. Pheromones. Worst case scenario, I can get 11 by doing that. I'd rather not, but I could get 11 from doing that. So... I'm going to give that a try probably on Sunday. So we'll see how that works out. I don't think it's going to work for me. But then again, I'm a pessimist sometimes, right? I'm going to try it. We'll see how far I can actually get. Now, as I understand, hold on a minute here. You know, I should have done this earlier. Boom. You guys just hang out for now. They say they made an adjustment in the termites. Is it for the good side or the bad side? I don't really know. Let's find out. After that, we'll probably do some combats um, because after all, I need pheromones, don't I? All right, so I'm hoping there, I should have turned that off earlier. All right, so hope, whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, oh, that's right, there's a uh, tiger beetle. He just spawned on the screen, by the way. I didn't summon him or anything like that. He's creature parts anyway. All right, so let's see how this is going to work out. Now, they say they adjusted the frequency, their, you know, and so, so we'll see how that works out. Did they make them harder or did they make them easier? I guess we're going to find that out. How are you guys doing? Okay, it looks like, um, at least I hope it is. I'm hoping they'll come up in the little wad, right? All right, and let's get this going right here. All right, let's just stand here. Okay, kill them, please. Kill them. All right, those are just workers. Those aren't the real dangerous ones. I mean, they'll kill you, but they don't really stand much of a chance against your soldiers, right? All right, how are things going? Okay, it looks like they're ready to go. Okay, and they have arrived. See, these are the guys who are dangerous. Okay, so let's go. Okay, I see somebody hanging out here. Okay, could we just get like a mass thing here? Kill him quickly. No losses, please. Thank you. All right, where is it still? I can't tell. I guess once we start killing them, we'll get an idea, right? All right, I am going to get these guys going up here right now. All right, come on up. Um, okay, they're kind of broken up there, aren't they? All right, so that's not terrific. So we're going to have to hold the position a little while. All right, let me just uh, wait for them to get in here. I'm watching the, the map on the side there to see if any of them come down. All right, are they coming in yet? Here they come. All right. All right, let's start uh, culling the herd here a bit. And recruit. Okay, you guys get up there. Recruit. 
Okay, unfortunately, they're breaking things up a bit here. If the guys would just stay together, that'd be great. All right, I still have 10 on the bottom, so nobody has died there. Okay, more please. All right, kill those please. Okay, up here guys, up here. Don't go wandering off over there, please. Okay, over here, recruit. Okay, my first group of uh, refreshed troops coming in here. Um, my first impression that it does seem to be a little bit better. All right, I'm still, is that the last worker? Yeah, I think that's the last worker. All right, let's, uh, okay, kill them here. Let's pull back, guys, let's pull back. All right, let's come down here. All right, I have 15 and they have, and we still have the 10 at the bottom here. So I think what I'm gonna do is I might just stand here and wait for them to come back. Okay, um, all right, we did lose one of those guys. And actually I lost one of the workers when that happened, didn't I? That's very unfortunate. I think it's one that I lost. All right, nine is still good, let's see. Okay, uh, I'm not gonna do anything like get anybody going here or anything like that, wrong one. All right, let's see. How are you guys doing? All right, I think I'm gonna try to hold the position and see if I can get them to come back. All right, but we have to like sit right here because this is where they're gonna be spawned. I want the maximum number of guys right here to kill them if they spawn here, right? I did lose two here, but it's not that big of a deal, I don't think, because let's face it, I think that, yeah, they're killing workers. So the workers aren't really that big of a deal. It's when the other guys with the claws, the big mandibles, those are the guys who are a problem. All right, they're coming back. All right, I, sh I need to start working back up again. All right, I have my full 15 though. So how, let's take a look and see what's going on up here. My initial impression, it does seem to be a bit easier, but we'll see. Okay, um, well, they've respawned, but then again, that's kind of what you would figure. All right, stay together, guys, please. Stay together. Stay together. Don't, don't uh, separate. You're stronger as a group, right? Okay, let's just sit right here and pick them off. Okay, the workers, like I said, workers... They're only a danger to you and the other workers, right? All right, kill them. Okay, some of my guys have rushed off on their own, I think. All right, recruit. Okay, get over here, get over here. No, no, okay, get over there, get over here. Kill them, kill them, kill them. Kill them, kill them. Okay, recruit again and recruit again. Okay, you gotta keep that concentration going there, right? All right, as soon as they're done, I'm out of here. Okay, and I have seven on the bottom. Okay, come on, recruit, and recruit again. It just occurred to me, did I actually turn on... Oh, they're beating on me! They're beating on me! Oh, that's very bad. Okay, well, I'm going to lose some of them now, right? You know what it is? I just realized that I don't think I turned that on. So I was going to run out of my, um, my guys there. All right, but I think that the workers, let me just take a quick look. All right, I'm completely dependent. What is that guy? Okay, he's, he, I'm going to lose some of my workers now. All right, let me just turn them off. Six. So far, I've lost six. All right, that's not so bad for two rounds. Oh, by the way, since... We're doing this. Why don't somebody just get to work over there? All right, let's get back. Oh, you know Recruit. All right, we got you. Let's get in here.
Okay, that's that's good enough. Let's get out of here. Okay, so what was the final death toll here? Okay, a hundred. So I lost eight. That was mostly because of me dying, because I was I my mind went somewhere else. And if you don't pay attention there, you're, you're gonna lose. All right. You know what? I should put them back on food duty, because that's basically what I was having them do is food, except for that one. All right. So let's head on back. All right. My impression is that the difficulty was reduced. That's my thought. If anybody else has tried it, what do you think? I, I seem to think that that was probably what happened because I got out of the first wave of there with basically I was able to refresh my troops and I had everybody there. I only really lost workers the second time around. Okay, by the way, disband because they were going crazy over here. All right, how am I doing with these guys? 50, okay, so how am I doing with the resin? Are they all in there? Okay, they're still putting it in there. That was probably a lot more beneficial than just doing the one wave. I mean, I did lose a few workers, but like I said, I probably lost the most of them because I got myself killed. If I was being more uh, careful, it probably wouldn't have been a problem. That looks like the final number there. All right, so basically I got the most of two complete waves in there, and my downtime is going to be very low, which is something that makes me happy. All right, so let's just do, let's go attack somebody, right? Maybe they have a hornet. Uh, yeah, somebody, some mean person just attacked me. Of course, do I really want to run it? Okay, I doubt this person has a hornet. I'm just saying that. Uh, let's see, because they don't have anything else. All right, let's just do this quickly and... And then move on to somebody, hopefully, who... Okay, lots of stuff on the outside. Lots of stuff on the outside. Okay, just stay away from me. Okay, you know what? Um, that up there. Beat on him, please. And you know what? Let's just get stuff going here. Because we have a fight out here, don't we? Okay, and that... Oh, and I got killed by a soldier. Thank you for looking out for your general. It was very nice of you. And yeah, all of my guys are... Okay. Yeah, unfortunately, they I didn't notice that they had a... Um, yeah, that, that's I think that's kind of the reason I died there. Okay, another bombardier. Here, have another one. And have another one. Gang up on him. Okay, at least my scorpions are still there. Okay, I'm guessing that everything is on the outside then because I saw everything on the outside. Okay, uh, could somebody take care of him, please? Okay, all five of you, please. All right, just get over here. Okay, what is going on down there? Okay, uh, I'm gonna have to get these guys down here. I might have to use stuff for myself. Okay, could somebody take care of these guys, please? I think I have plenty of time because I think everything was outside. Okay, do I have anybody left? I have four. All right, let's go on in. All right, could you kill those guys, please? Kill them one at a time, please. All right, kill them off. Kill them off one at a time. All right, these guys too. Yeah, yeah, it's all alone, isn't it? Okay, then any soldiers left? Okay, no soldiers left. All right, so... I know that because the, um, if there were soldiers in here, the creatures would not have attacked. Yeah, I, I don't know about that strategy. I mean, it did kill all of my soldiers and increases my downtime, but if there's nobody in here, I, I just don't get the sense of that. All right, and let's start this going. All right, we'll do one more fight, but of course that's going to be after a um, a bit of a delay while my forces reload. The soldiers are back, so let's uh, let's try again. 
Hopefully there's lots of rewards here. Okay, that's much better. I'm really happy with that. And uh, hopefully it's a strong team. And hopefully they don't need these resources to become a strong team. Because I'm going to take them all the way. It's just the name of the game, right? All right, so let's see. What do we have here? All right, we have a bunch of you guys. So can you have him? Have some fun with him for a moment. He's good at parties. Oh, boom! There we go. Come on. Do it again. Do it again. It's fun at parties. Boom. Okay. He's killing a lot of them, which is very good. All right. You know what? I think that's a pretty good chunk of them taken care of here. So why don't we just take care of the rest? Okay. I'm getting beat up. Okay. Well, thank you. My sister saved me. Okay, uh, sorry about that, dude, but, you know, that is the reason we have you along, you know? Just saying. All right, do we have anybody in the hallway? I mean, we didn't have anybody there. Okay, so... Okay, so everybody... Wow, it's really crowded in there. And you know what? There's a whole bunch of bombardiers in there, isn't there? All right, so let's do this and then do this. Okay, and get in here. Just kill anybody you can. Put him over there, put him, okay, put him over there, put him here. Okay, you know, disband. Let the fight begin, right? Let them fight. Okay, I think that my rhino is about to, no, actually, I think, is my rhino dead? No, no, he's still there. He's coming over to me. Mommy, I'm hurt. Okay, um... I, I, I still see my five scorpions, and that's usually a good sign. Yeah, I, th I think we got this. All right, I'm gonna recall these guys back, just in case. Yeah, I do believe that that's it. All right, you wanna take care of this, guys? Yeah, that's the reason I have five scorpions. Actually, I have six. And, uh, yeah, that is much better. That's much better. Okay, I like getting stuff. Uh, as I mentioned, uh, in case I didn't mention it, I actually have a uh, third uh, five-star scorpion. I think eventually I'm going to try to do the uh, four-starring. I would really like to upgrade the friendship chamber first, though, you know, because I'd like to increase it better than 7%. 7% just seems to be frivolous. And by the way, you also noticed that my gem total dropped because I opened up another slot here. So, I mean, there's no rush for getting rid of him. So, and I don't want to really substitute him in for anything else. I like having three bombardiers. The rhino is useful at times, so is the dragonfly. And I like to have one tiger beetle because they are good at taking out ants. They're not so good with the other creatures, but they are pretty good at taking out ants quickly. So I like to have at least one of them. I'm holding on to the other one because maybe I'll get a four-star one of them one of these days, right? And we'll just start doing this. Anyway, I think that's going to be it for now. So we have some updates here, mostly for the, uh, the beehive. And these are very good changes here. Cost less to do it. You get more time by default. If you upgrade, you get even more time. Very, very nice. And of course, we also took a trip over to the, uh, the termites. And from my experience, just from what we just saw, it does seem to be uh, a little bit easier. I'm going to have to go all the way up there to get the leaf. It seems to be a little bit easier now. And I think that that's actually pretty darn good. Anyway, I think that's going to be it for now. So I am planning for the next video, which is going to be Sunday, to take a run through the beehive. I don't necessarily think it's going to be successful, but I'm going to give it my best shot. So we'll see what happens by then. Um, by the way, if anybody has distinct knowledge about whether or not the golden summon, you know, if you have the honeycomb, will actually get you a golden hornet, please let me know. Because you know what? I would really hate to do that have the thing sitting in my mouth, hit that button, and get a golden spider. You know what I would do at that point? 
I'd find out how many creature parts I could get from it. Anyway, thank you very much for your attention. I really appreciate it. And play games, because games are fun. See ya!